Hello YouTube, it is Danielle. Today is Wednesday, May 30th, 2012. Um, this is going to be like my week 3 check-in for the 6 week Skellis Challenge, which was cancelled Saturday or Sunday. So, <clears throat> yeah, so I just wanted to come on here real quick, do um, my measurements for you guys, because I don't know if anybody actually kept up with the measurements or anything since it went was off and it ended so um this is real quick sorry the place looks different behind me because you can tell got that stupid bed up against the wall um just real quick me and my husband re, re uh we re-signed our lease here so we're gonna be at this apartment for another 13 months and um so I decided, hey, we're going to be here for another year. I want to decorate. I want to make this place feel like more homey instead of just an apartment since... Sorry, I also just got out of the shower. This place will let us redecorate and do it however we want as long as it's back to the way it was whenever we moved in. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be painting and putting things on the walls and making it feel more like a home instead of just an apartment. So that bed is going to go either in a garage sale, Craigslist, something. It's getting out of here. We don't need the spare bed. We have a wonderful basset couch and the pull-out mattress in there is amazing and we know because we slept on it for about two months after my ankle surgery before I could go to our bedroom and sleep comfortably in there because the way me and my husband sleep it was opposite sides of what we needed to be. So he'd be, he was too scared to sleep in our regular bed in our normal positions of bumping my ankle right after surgery so we slept on the pull-out couch which worked better because the way it was set up in our living room it just worked better for us to sleep in there and that couch is wonderful so if we have any guests they can sleep out there they'll have the TV they'll have access to the kitchen easier and everything before if we're there before us so it's just the way it's gonna be now so yeah ready to say goodbye to that bed and I'm going to be turning my desk over against this wall here so that way I won't have any lighting issues, hopefully, but I moved my light over there today instead of over here. So anyways, <clears throat> back to the measurements. I did measure myself today, actually just a little bit right after I got out of the shower, and only one, two, four things changed. Everything else pretty much stayed the same, but like my arm stayed the same, but I can definitely tell it's not because they're getting fatter or anything, and it's just the way they are. I have started to work out my arms and do strength training so they're going to get smaller and or larger depending on what needs to happen I guess later on you know. So for the big changes here um, my chest I, I measured in the same bra that I was wearing whenever I first did it and my chest went down three and a half inches my waist which I told y'all I measured from my smallest part of my body which is that, like whenever you go get fitted for formal stuff, that's where they do your waist at. That went down, I said my chest was three and a half, my waist was four and a half inches. My hips are the biggest change and they have uh, gone down obviously. But my hips changed five and a half inches, so I lost five and a half inches in my hips. And then also my calves lost an inch, both of them. So, that's pretty good. My neck stayed the same. My um, my arms stayed the same, but they, they look different to me. So, I mean, something is changing in there. My thighs. Did my thighs change? Oh, it looks like my right thigh. My right thigh. My right thigh um, gained half an inch. So, it means they're getting stronger. And I'm fine with that. Uh, I've never really had big legs to begin with in general. So that's yeah, fine if they get a little more bulked up to me. And my ankles stayed the same. Calves went down an inch. So yeah, that is it. And I will be with you guys on Monday, June 4th, 2012 for my week 8 and week 9 recap since I didn't do one this Monday. Um... I think that is it. I'm about to head out and do my errands for the day. So, sorry. Sorry. Since I have been, it's my day off, I've been cleaning around here and 
to the dog for a walk, worked out, did a lot of things around the house, and now it's time for me to do stuff out of the house and get ready for belly dancing later tonight. So, I will see you guys on Monday. Hope everybody has a good week, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!